Berry Farm is pleased to present Crazy Kirk and the Hillbillies. Off, you were late, but you know what? It was good. It was boisterous. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for being here, y'all. We have a job because you folks come out here and yell yeehaw. We have a job because Knott's Berry Farm, they care a whole lot about live music. And we can't get this show going until we get this fire started. We have a... Dr. Robert is our fire starter. This is one of the most dangerous jobs in the park. Cover your faces, kids. Turn your bullet. Everybody kill. Watch out. Get ready. Get ready. Come on. Get ready. And ignition five. Starting the fire. Getting the blaze in it. <laughs>
We're trying to listen to all kinds of music with an open mind and an open heart, trying to listen to what's going on out there. And then, of course, we are, we've been around for a while. We're not particularly young. And, uh, so we uh, really like those classic rock and roll songs. Really fond of Motown music. So let's do some Motown. Let's get that Motown thing going with bluegrass. Let's call it Mograss. This is our tribute to the Temptations.
song and maybe say that you people who don't know who we are probably wonder what I'm talking about when I'm talking about having teeth in my pocket. Who do we have here that's screaming on a roller coaster? Okay. Who do we have here seeing us for the first time? Alright, thank you. How many people do we have here who have never seen us before? Interesting. Well, it just so happens you have a cute baby, and this is your first time here, and this is something that you need to know, is that we do a thing where we pass the cutest baby around the audience. Don't bother the baby, sir. You've got the baby now, and you get a minute. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think that's really going to happen. I was so mad. I that's the first time that's actually really happened. We're going to do a song by a famous Texan. Anybody here from Texas? Is there anybody that's actually here from Texas or you're, you're an actual Texan? El Paso, Texas. Well, it's good to have you here, El Paso. A song by a famous Texan Bob Wills, the king of Western swing, known for making this sound. <gasps> known for great songs like this. Let's do San Antonio Rose.
ladies and gentlemen, we're going to do our version of a very famous song called The Devil Went Down to Georgia. But we're not going to do it in the traditional sense, we're going to do it in the theatrical sense. We're going to tell the story theatrically using theatrics. We will need a storyteller, or what we like to refer to as the teller of the story. And the teller of the story will be portrayed and performed by the fellow who can learn lots and lots of dialogue, lots of words. And that fellow is right over here. Look at how intelligent he looks. <laughs> Whistling Rick! <laughs> the glasses too, because those glasses make you look smart. They help you remember stuff. <laughs> Animal Landers will be playing a regular banker, just a, a regular banker in the village. And then I want you to, I want you to be a nice banker. And then lose that character and become evil demon electric bassist. <laughs> Animal Landers. <laughs> playing a character in our village who has trouble doing most things, <laughs> except he's brilliant when it comes to being a drummer. He is our village savant percussionist, Bam Bam! <laughs> Playing the title role, and the title role of this piece. is going to be performed by Eric the Great, right over here. And this, it is the title role, and it is also the villain. And that's what he excels and exceeds at. He's a fine musician, but I think he's even much better as an actor. And you'll see him do some of his finest work just about, in about 30 seconds. And the, I think he starts out strong and s maintains that through the, the piece. I don't even know why I said that. <laughs> Hold on a second, I gotta think. Oh yes, you're gonna recognize the melody and you're gonna wanna clap. I ask you not to clap until I cue you during the end in order to help elevate the ending. Speaking of elevating the ending, every single time we perform this, you might not believe this, but every single time we perform this, we received a standing ovation. And I mean a strong one. I don't mean like a pittery, little weak little thing. I mean, boom, people jump up every time. So, just telling you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our rendition of The Devil Went Down to Georgia.
Here, let me show you how.